I don't know that reality has really set in for the Jets yet, and it may not until the team goes out to play on Sunday and Aaron Rodgers isn't there. The talk across the league is all about who the Jets can bring in to save their season, but head coach Robert Sala has made it very clear that Zach Wilson will be the guy. Sala told the media that the Jets have faith in Wilson and pointed out that he was 5-1 last season before the bye week and half the offense got injured. I'm sure that the Jets will bring in another quarterback to back up Zach, but Sala has made it very clear that such a move would only be to add another veteran presence to the quarterback room and he would not be competing with Zach for the starting spot. Sala also said that they would not be bringing in another quarterback this week. They're going to roll with Zach and Tim Boyle against Dallas. The consensus seems to be that the Jets will roll with Wilson for the first five or six games of the season, and if he is holding the team back, then they will go another direction. But otherwise, he will continue to start. And I want to go back to the comment by Sala about Zach being 5-1 and one last season before the bye. And I think it's a great point because when you look at last season, Zach played pretty well until Brees Hall and Elijah Vera Tucker went down. After that is when things started to go downhill. The offensive line still isn't great this year, but the team is honestly solid everywhere else. I think the defense is better than last year, the running back room is one of the best in the league, and Garrett Wilson is ready for a breakout year. All that being said, I think Brees Hall is going to be the key for the Jets this season. When he is healthy, he opens up so much for the Jets offense. We already saw it on Monday night. So I think if he is able to return to 100%, the Jets can still make the playoffs.